We got at Soka Glam. We got Glam I Am. We got Glowing Glam I Am. We got our Soko Glam Glowing Glass Honey Skin Glam I Am. We are Glam I Am or Soko Glam. Yay! Hoo! Mountain Dew. Okay, we're done. Hey Glow Beauties, I have a Korean K-Beauty SoCo Glam skincare haul for you today. I swear to goodness, I think that my iPhone listens to my conversations or even reads my mind because the other day I was thinking, you know what, I need some more of my holy grail skincare. I was thinking I might want to add something else into the haul. And you know what, I have fact on this because I do recall having a conversation when I was at a party where somebody said that their daughter works for Apple and apparently there is a function on your iPhone that does listen to what you're saying and you actually have to turn it off and then I forgot where it was so I guess it's listening to my my conversations because I was thinking and I think I might have even mentioned that I wanted this particular Claire's product I really thought that okay now's the time I probably need to get it and would you know Facebook and IG does listen to things so you better you might want to check that out but wouldn't you know it the very next day I got an email from Soko Glam saying that they have a Claire's promotion where if you purchase a certain amount of Claire's products they're gonna throw in a Claire's item and that I think it was something like 50% off or 25% off any Claire's item that you purchase so with that that was my in <laughs> to purchasing making this haul that's how this one got started so I'm thinking my iPhone was listening to my conversation so it's a little bit of a scary biscuit it's a little spooky I don't know what's going on with it but there you have it that's how I got my haul so let's get in I really 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 love Korean skincare they're incredibly innovative they spend a lot a lot of resources and manpower and knowledge in research and development. They employ so much of the natural habitat to bring in all the plant goodness and the sea goodness and whatever goodness into their skincare. There's a lot of research. Then not only that, their packaging is amazing, their presentation, the innovation in the delivery systems of their products and their long-standing culture, historical culture in the way that they do skincare. And then their approach to skincare, which has really informed me in the way I do skincare with a lot of hydrating layers first before I put on the occlusive layers that really brings in the hydration to the deeper levels of your skin, uh, their approach to exfoliation. There's so much and the neat thing about it is because we're so much more of a global society, we are sharing our knowledge with each other. Us North Americans are becoming way more knowledgeable as a result of the Korean and the Japanese Asian influx of knowledge in skincare. It is a booming business and it's booming in knowledge and the sharing of knowledge and research and development is going to go through the roof because of it. So I love my Korean skincare and my Japanese skincare. So let's truly get in. I don't even know where to start. It's kind of hard. I did add in a couple of products that I did purchase from another haul from Soko Glam. And Soko Glam is a wonderful, it's a kind of like a one-stop shop for Korean skincare. It's not overwhelming. So it's a nice place to start when you want to purchase Korean skincare. So the first one I picked up was, uh, I'm already using it now, the Neogen. This is a sunscreen. It's one of their popular sunscreen called Advanced Sun Protection Solution Daily Light Protection Sunscreen SPF 50 PA++++. It's almost short of the four pluses. I forgot what it means, but it means that it's like the sun protection is really powerful in SPF 50. When I first apply it, yes, it does kind of give a little bit 
of that kind of whitish thing as you're spreading it and then it just settles and then it kind of goes away. Um, and it has a little bit, it's just a little bit more feeling of an oiliness feeling than my Paula's Choice, just a tad bit more, but then it settles down, locks down, and, and then I'm fine. So I really, really love this. When I go out, I use this one. When I stay indoors right now, I'm using my years old Paula's Choice one, and then when I go out, I'm using this one. I do not reapply because I wear makeup. I'm not gonna reapply over my makeup. That's just not practical. I mean, ideally you should, but I'm not even gonna go there. I don't reapply, but it works for me. And I tan very, very, very fast. And this does help me to slow down my tan, and I know I'm getting the UVA and the UVB protection, and I'm getting all round protection because it's got the PA plus 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 so that is really awesome the next one that I picked up was another Neogen product and this one I wanted to get it because I heard that it is a dupe for the Tatcha the essence and a way more affordable dupe let me tell you more like a quarter of the price this is Neogen's real ferment micro essence with 93% micro skin ferment complex because it's a uh, it's a combination of different ferment extracts. Now let me just go to my notes. So to explain it a little bit, it has three different fermented main ingredients. One is the fermented yeast, which is called Saccharomyces ferment filtrate at 28%. Then it has fermented rice, which is 9%, which is rice ferment filtrate, which is basically sake and it brings in the minerals, the amino acids, the vitamins, the antioxidants, also organic acids, so it's going to help very gently slough off the dead layers of your skin at all the same time. That's what the rice ferment sake makers, their skin, their they were, you know, the older people where they had the weathered face, but they had smooth hands. And that was because they were constantly in this brew of sake and the fermentation. So they honed it and this has it in there. It's just called by a different name. And then the fermented birch extract, 17%. These fermented ingredients helps to nourish skin, amino acids, which are very moisturizing. It also includes sodium hyaluronic lactobacillus, niacinamide, helps to keep your pores small, closed, adenosine, so it has really good ingredients in here. I haven't started using it yet because I'm still using my Fresh's kombucha, so after I use that, this is going into my rotation, and I'm really looking forward to using it because after I wash my face, I put on this essence to start. If I want to put on a toner, I'll put on a toner first and then the essence and then I'll go in with my serum. So this is how I do it because it starts the process of rehydrating the skin and you're rehydrating it with a concentrated liquid that is like giving you a boost of nutrition to start your skincare process. Awesome. It may look like water, but it ain't water. Now. What I had wanted to purchase was my holy grail of holy grail products. If I could buy like 20 of them at a time, I would. And this is the Claire's, Dear Claire's Toner Mate 2-in-1 Cotton Pads. And they come in, you get 60 of the sponge cotton pads and you get 60 of the compressed cotton pads that have more of a texture on it. This is my holy grail, the sponge cotton pads. And I'm telling you, this is miracle pads forget about I am sorry I am sorry for what is the um, the famous one that everybody talks about my god I cannot remember it's a Japanese company they put out one that is very famous which I used to love editing Kim to the rescue Shiseido facial cottons ding dong but this trumps it tenfold. This is a sponge cotton. When you put the product on it, it soaks it up 
but then when you put it on your face, it spits right back out onto your face. Literally. Whatever, it's like putting it on your hand and getting it on your head instead of getting it all over your hand. This kind of contains it and then spits it on back on your face. So you're just getting it all over and you can control the amount that you're getting on your face instead of your hands getting all over and you're trying to get it on and your divot in your hand is not quite getting there and your hand's so big. This thing will just get it all on. Bada bing, bada boom. And if they could just make this box with the whole thing with these ones, I would be in seventh heaven. As it is, what I do is I cut them in half. The other one, this one, I don't really like it that much, but I'm trying to learn to love it and use it for my toner. It has a texture to it, so it feels kind of scrubby on the face, and it doesn't do that, soak it in, spit it out. This one doesn't do that. I'm not impressed after having this one. Nonetheless, I'm going to use it for my toners and make use out of it because I got to use it up. But this thing is magical. Once you arrive onto this, you will never go back. Prior to finding out about this, I picked up Kinky Sweat loves these ones, and this is how I found out about this. But this was before I found out about this. This is White Rabbit Premium Cosmetic Cotton Sheets. You get this also at Soko Glam, and it comes in, I can't remember how many. I'll put it up on the screen. You get a lot, and what I do is I cut them in half. They come like this, but they're really this. And they're cotton, but they won't spit out. They're not going to do what these innovative uh, toner mate, Claire's toner mate does. So it comes like this. This is the poor cousin version of this because it will still soak it up and it will get on your face. But this is great for if you want to do a, you know, one of those cotton mask things. But and it will get it on your face, and I cut them in half, but this is nothing in comparison to the sponges by Claire. If you're gonna go on to Soko Glam and pick up anything, I am telling you, this is the way to go. If you wanna pick up something to do masking with quickie, put your essence on it and sit it on your face, then go with this, because you won't be using uh, the golden duck here, okay? So this is how I would do it. This one was thrown in the bunch for me. This was the freebie, and this is the Claire's Moisturizing Skin Program. What is it? Supple Preparation Unscented Toner. I didn't even open it, you guys. Let me see whether I can get it open. The toner is only $22 and you get six fluid ounces. They say this new unscented version of the, their cult favorite toner still helps prep your skin to absorb serums better by removing excess dirt and sebum using amino acids and ingredients like licorice root, aloe leaf extract, and centella asiatica. Centella asiatica is an amazing ingredient. It's very calming, it's very healing. It also helps to heal pimples. It's something that you really want in skincare and it's a very popular skincare ingredient in KB beauty and it's also branching over into North of the North American the Western market too you know brands are cottoning on to Centella Asiatica so look out for that because it's a quite a powerful and healing ingredient it's all in this Claire's toner so now I can use my compressed Claire's cotton with this one this is the Cosrx advanced nail 96 mucin power essence as you can see there is a trend. I love my essences <laughs> because they're powerful and you can hone your essence to your skin's needs, your skin's wants, what ingredients you want to be concentrating on and getting first dibs into deep into the layers of your skin. So this one is really, really good healing, regenerating. It's almost like a natural epidermal growth factor. Snail mucin basic, basically is a growth factor. It's a natural epidermal growth factor. It also is very healing, very soothing to the skin, helps with pimples and acne. Mucin actually means 
mucus is what comes off the snail when the snail is going on a surface and you see that glidey thing it allows the snail to glide I think it has a lot of amino acids in it and I think it also has a lot of gentle exfoliating organic exfoliator in it so it's doing all that stuff in a mucus format <laughs> so this is 96 percent of it so there you go and i am all in for that though i'm waiting a little bit because i wanted to get off prednisone first before i try something like that because it is an animal derived product and something like that as much as it is natural it's still coming from an animal and i do have to be a little bit careful because my immune system is low. Always check for your, with your doctor about things like that when you're dealing with types of animal products. Like I'm not supposed to be eating sushi whilst I'm on prednisone. That's a raw and then this is kind of raw in a way. I think there was something that if you buy a number of them you get uh, one free. Don't quote me on this because I picked up this box a little while ago and I kind of forgot. But anyway, I think I had my eye on this. I think I must have been watching a lot of masking videos and this was coming up as a really good one. Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Tensile Sheet Mask. So I thought, why the heck not? I am on the Soko Glam website. They sell this product. Might as well get a couple of them. So how many did I get? One, two, three, four, five. So I got five of these and they feel like they're nice and rich and yummy. I don't know what the main ingredients are in this. Aloe, the top ingredients, ceramides. You can't just put ceramides and not allow it to work. It has to be with the right combination of ingredients and the right amount. They've got it right here. They've got the ceramides and they've got the phytofinchicine and I believe, I'm hoping they will have the cholesterol because the cholesterol also has to be included in here for it to work properly. So it's a nicely formulated mask so I'm all set for my mask. And they always give you a little extra, a little kind of pouch and this is really nice because it's a nice traveling pouch and it says only good skin days ahead because when you do a nice skincare routine you help to heal your skin and then maybe you'll even get honey skin now it's not just glass skin it is honey skin honey skin is like the step above glass skin apparently so anyway what I got was they threw in this this is by easy do and it's the repair renewal moisture so i'm assuming this is a moisturizer and they give you two of them which is really great but listen to what it says because this is no ordinary moisturizer launched in 2006 by dueno pharmacy easy do believes that beauty begins with healthy skin patented formula with medical grade egf which is epidermal growth factor effectively targets wrinkles and skin damage while minimizing irritation providing a daily skin solution for sensitive skin and learn more yes epidermal growth factor is very powerful same with peptides now uh, the brand that did the first introduction to peptides was Dr. Paracone. Dr. Paracone was one of the first ones to do peptides. When he listed them, he listed them correctly as neuropeptides. They're shortened amino acid chains, but they're neuropeptides. With that, they do affect the kind of in the neurological way in the skin, and they stimulate. Epidermal growth factor is like a juiced up version like it's a powerful version and epidermal growth factor will heal like nobody's business if you have i used to do uh, take a skin cream years ago they still sell that brand in holt renfew very expensive they had the epidermal growth factor they had other growth factors also of course drunk elephant now puts epidermal growth it's very powerful what it would do is if i had a pimple or if i had a scar or if i had a cystic acne coming up that would take over a month to heal and would leave the most horrific scar on my skin because i never healed well with any sort of pimples because of my tan skin so that would leave a horrific mark if i put the skin cream that had the epidermal 
normal growth factor in it, that thing would heal in like four to five days. And that would normally have taken a whole month or more to heal. I would have to run to the doctor and have them give a cortisone shot to bring it down so it wouldn't leave a horrific scar. But I didn't have to do that back then because of the epidural growth factor and that by then it was really hard to get to the doctor to get those. So I was using this. This thing was healing in five days. It was better than the cortisone shot and I literally had no scar. It fe speed healed and left me with no scar, like nothing ever happened. However, I then tried to do buy um, from a different brand that was much more affordable. And somebody had said something about, you know, brands will have something that's affordable and uh, another band is more luxury, and but they may be getting, have the same ingredients. And I'm going, well, why is it the same? Because they're sourcing it from a cheaper source or a more refined, better source. Turns out it's true, because I thought it was just an urban legend, so I bought this version, like way more affordable version. I used that, I was getting a cystic pimple again, a really bad one, I put that on. Yes, it healed it fast, but not as fast as the other one. It healed it in uh, twice, it took, instead of the three to four days that it took for the other one, it took like more like seven to eight or nine days. But when it healed, what it did was it speed, speed healed a scar. So it was like the way I would have scarred if I hadn't put anything on, but it would speed, it speed healed it into a scar. Whereas the proper one, the very expensive one, speed healed it, truly healed it. No scar, no nothing. So it really is important where they're sourcing these growth factors, what companies they're getting them from, because you can get cheap ones that will do the job but do it horrifically and heal you into a scar very fast, speed heal a scar, or it will heal a good one. Sorry I'm going on a tangent because I think this is really, really important to know. So hopefully they're sourcing the good stuff. However, I have to be careful with epidermal growth factors and peptides. I'm very sensitive to neuropeptides and epidermal growth factor is another neuropeptide. A couple of years ago when I started using this, so maybe about eight, 10 years ago when I was using this, it would take me about five months for my body to actually get used to using a peptide. So I would kind of go slowly every other day, every third day, because literally I would buzz. I would get a kind of formication sort of, sort of surface buzz from my uh, feet up to my waist. Well, not a surface buzz, it would kind of buzz when I used any sort of peptides and any sort of epidermal growth factors. They were the worst. So I'd have to kind of go slow about it. And then after about four to five months, my body would get used to it. But it was a long haul for my body to get used to these neuropeptides in the skincare. Quite powerful things. So my body is like the canary in a coal mine. So it picks up on things that other people don't won't necessarily pick up on. But with that, I highly encourage people not to use it if they're pregnant or breastfeeding. This is one of those ingredients that I think are like vitamin that are like retin A that should not be used when you're pregnant or breastfeeding or becoming want to become pregnant. I think you should stay away from all peptides and all growth factors in skincare. I'm just saying, because I don't think they're as benign as we all think they are. I hope you enjoyed my K-Beauty Soko Glam skincare haul. I think the iPhone was listening to me and I got a good deal. I think it was like 20 to 25% off. And I got this toner thrown in, a very popular Claire's toner. So I am a happy little camper with my iPhone listening Korean skincare haul. So if you enjoyed my SoCo Glam K Beauty Korean skincare haul, only good skincare days ahead at Soko Glam IG and SokoGlam.com. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up, like and share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to keep up with my videos. Hit the bell notification button so you won't miss out on any of my uploads. And remember, rock your own beautiful glass honey gorgeousness and keep on going and keep on glowing. I will. <laughs>
just pick up one of the toner mates. I picked up not only two, I picked up three. Yes, and if I could have picked up like 10, I would have. If I could have picked up 20, I would have done that too. We got skincare days. We got glowing honey skincare days. We got only good glowing honey skincare days. We got only good glowing glass skin honey skincare days ahead. Yes. <laughs> It's a wrap, it's a wrap, it's a wrap, it's a wrap.